Hyperlinks DRC checks for metal islands on the board. Having floating metal islands can act as an antenna, causing EMI failures. Hyperlinks DRC checks for such issues and flags them as violations. Generally, this rule is run on the whole design, but it can be run on specific electrical nets if required. For demo purpose, I am checking for metal islands for the entire design. Hyperlinks DRC considers these three parameters to define the size of the metal island irrespective of its shape. Any metal shape that is not connected to a pin or via and exceeds the thresholds defined in here is considered a violation. Let's run the rule and take a look at the violations. Looks like the rule is flagging these as violations. These are pin pads and are purposely created. I will go ahead and mark this as ignored. But some of the violations are actually unintentional. In this section, a cluster of vias is cutting off a part of the plane creating a floating metal island. The layout engineer can delete some of these vias and fix the problem. I am going to go ahead and mark this as to be fixed. This way, Hyperlinks DRC can detect potential EMI issues that otherwise might have been overlooked.